A woman was found dead today at Chingmeidong Cemetery as per a report. The deceased has been identified as one Mona Day as 20 years from Chingmeidong Lei in Kol Imphal East. Further details are awaited. In a separate incident, body of a man was found at the canal of NHPC Loktak Road in Bishnupur District. It is believed that the deceased was a resident of Upokpi village in Bishnupur District. As part of our mission Green Manipur, JCILPS Manipur Updates and Unlimited Working Club have jointly organized a tree plantation program at Nomai Ching, including the graveyard of Lamjing Mera Robin Hood at Awang Ching, Imphal East today. Director of Tourism Department Waikom Ibohol said the program was conducted in order to help curb the fast-changing climatic conditions, especially in Manipur. Lining Thao Sana Mahi Sana Pung LSSP Kanglai Park organized an awareness from discussion program on traditional dresses and costumes at GEM Hall in fall today. Art and Culture Minister L. Jayante Kumar attended the program. In his speech, the minister called for a united Manipur and to end the controversy surrounding Mite and Mite. In order to transport relief materials to the flood affected areas in Assam and Bihar, the railway board has issued some guidelines. As per sources, Indian Railway has decided to permit interstate and intrastate free transport for aid and relief material by good trains, parcel van, including in less than standard composition wrecks to Bihar and Assam states in the wake of flood. After nearly two weeks, the flood's water has slowly started receding across Assam, bringing much need relief to the more than 55 lakhs people who have been hit by the disaster. Controversial Bangladeshi author Tasmana Slim's residence permit has been extended for one year by the Union Home Ministry, officials said today. Naslin, a citizen of Sweden, has been getting residence permit on a continuous basis since 2004. Naslin had to leave Bangladesh in 1994 in the wake of death threat by fundamentalist outfits for her alleged anti-Islamic views. Since then, she has been living in exile.